Hello, I'm going to give you a quick demo on how to use Snapshot for managed services. So first you're going to want to select a snapshot item and drag it out to the desktop. Double click it. You can log into any Salesforce org and take a snapshot. And what this does is it creates a metadata picture of the org and you can use all of that information to report on the org, to find everything that's wrong with it, and then to fix those problems. All right, now we have a snapshot. Let's get started. Let's get started with the forgotten assets report. Now this report will show you 50 or 60 metadata types down the left hand side. And all you have to do is select a type and it will show you the assets that are not being used, are hidden, are inactive, or not being referenced by any other metadata asset. So for example, we can look at custom applications and we see that some of them are not visible in any profile or permission set. We can select assignment rules and see that some of them are not active. We can select Apex classes and see the classes that are not being referenced by any other metadata assets and therefore are never run. We can find duplicate methods and unused methods as well. Let's look at email templates. And now we see that quite a few of our email templates are not being referenced by anything. So this report is really easy to run. You just check the things that you're interested in, go to the Display Report tab, and Snapshot will create a comprehensive report on all the metadata that's not being used. You can share this report with your customer. Go into Smart Deploy and remove these assets with our deployment tools. Now you can run the same report again and show the progress. Now let's take a look at Org Health Scan. So this is like forgotten assets, except instead of looking at individual pieces of metadata, this looks at other problems with the org. So for example, this test right here under compliance audit, too many required fields on the page layout. Now the best practice says that you really don't want more than four required fields on a page layout. And you can adjust what the test will show in case you have a different best practice. But in order to run the report, all you do is go to the Preview Report tab, and it will find the page layouts that have too many required fields and give you a link so you can jump directly in to make changes. And as you can see, there's a whole bunch of really effective tests here. For example, looking at best practices, it finds objects with too many validation rules, too many record types, objects that mix, triggers, workflows, and flows, cases that are overdue, leads that don't have valid information, so on and so forth. So you can simply come here, check all of these reports, go to the Display Report tab, and you will get a comprehensive list of problems with this org that can all be fixed. So there we go. We now have a comprehensive list of everything wrong with this org. Items in green are passing the test. The items in yellow are warnings. The items in red are failures. And we've got details on the actual assets and every single issue that led to those findings. Once again, you can run this on the org, fix all the problems, run the report again, and show your customers the progress. Snapshot has a fantastic field usage report. You can select any of your objects over here at left and any subset of records or all of your records and go to the Preview Report tab and Snapshot will generate a very comprehensive field usage report with fields that are underutilized, marginally utilized, and fully utilized. You can select any of the fields and get a value distribution over here at right. You can even edit the security and compliance information right from the report. And of course, you can go to the Display Report tab and get all of the selected objects in a comprehensive report that's automatically linked to our deployment tools so you can clean up the org as well. I also recommend the pick list usage and last activity date reports for managed services. Uh, last activity date will show objects and other assets that have not been used recently. But let's take a look at user connection cleanup. Turns out that inactive users can remain connected to your Salesforce org in over 50 different ways, and this causes lots of problems. Not only can the user be connected, but their email address can still be used in the org in various different places. User Connection Cleanup finds all of these problems, cleans them up, and reports on them. 
Let's select a bunch of users over here at left and a bunch of categories of connection over here at right and go to the display report tab. Now the connections in green are probably okay. The connections in yellow don't look good and the connections in red definitely need to be fixed. You can go to the user cleanup tab and remove all of those connections or replace the inactive user. Once again, you can show this report to your customer with all of these problems. Come here, clean it up, and then show them the progress. Snapshot has extremely strong reporting on Apex code quality and coverage. The quality report will let you select any number of your Apex classes and get detailed quality information here in the middle pane. You can even call out where all of these different problems are. You can use our artificial intelligence engine to explain the functional spec best practices or code quality of any of these classes. If you go to the display report tab, you can generate a comprehensive quality report on all of the Apex and any problems that you might find there. This is a great way to document the progress cleaning up Apex in the org. Lastly, Snapshot has really strong support for artificial intelligence and prompt engineering. Metadata Studio offers prompt automation, which lets you run a prompt on every single asset in the org. You can use this to transform or document the entire org. We have over a hundred pre-built prompts that let you do all kinds of fantastic things, like analyze the quality of email templates, look for Apex classes that violate the security policies of the company, document all of your flows, create security descriptions and compliance information for all of your custom fields, create a report that tells what all of your flows do, look for problems in your role hierarchy. This is a great opportunity for a managed service provider to create new products that customers really need. All right, there's a quick overview of some of the things you can do with Snapshot in a managed services situation.